A great day here in Bloomington, Minnesota. The Sibley Warriors are taking on the Bloomington Jaguars. Let's set the scene. Sibley's Tori Nelson is about to create a little history tonight. We're here early in the first half. Cordy sets up under the basket. The team clears. They're going to clear. There's the ball. Tori down the block. If you look, it's in. It's a basket. Oh, it's a good ball. 2,000 points. Yes, the crowd goes wild. With our friends over at Univision, see what their call was. La capital Hook Corry, tira el pelota, grita la jugada. Or, or, y Rosca, salen, fuera, Nelson, corre hasta el bloque, recibe el pase, y gira, canasta, canasta, canasta. El público va loco, eh, canasta, Torri Nelson. Yo de regreso desde Univision, gracias, profe. Felicidades a Tony Nelson. Well, gracias, Tino. Thank you very much from Univision. And now, the word is passed out throughout the world. Let's find out what they say. Wow, binabati kita kasi narinig ko na naka-obscure ka ng dalawang libo. At di na ako pa kanimwala. Binabati kita. Sabi ni Shukro Patrike, siyo siri siya finale windis der mukhumuki hape Bangladesh. Nasta shuru Bangladesh shomoy jikil pune chata. Siri siya group champion hui finale uthe chye chai gana. Yu fa bu hai lang feng bao chao hong se jing bao. Yu ji tian tu jiang yi mei xiang shi ar shi dao ar shi wu gong li zuo de su du. Ji xu xiang xi tian bei fang xiang yi dong qiang du. Over 2500 points, that's incredible! I'm now on the phone with Jalen Roska, point guard for Sibley. Jalen, how is Tori as a teammate? Honestly, I don't even know if I have enough words to describe how Tori was. She was probably one of the best teammates I have ever had, ever been a part of, played with. The most humble person I have ever met. Every day at practice, she had a positive attitude. Every day she was cheering on, on, her, on all her teammates, whether or not we were winning or losing or coaches were mad or if coaches were happy, she always came to practice ready to perform and ready to work hard. Thank you, Jalen. Now I've got on the phone the shooting guard for Sibley, Hope Cordy. Hope, tell me, what do you think about Tori's accomplishment? I think Tori accomplishing 2,500 points above is just absolutely incredible. It's very unheard of in high school basketball, especially at Henry Sibley, and she's just the most deserving person of this award, and she's just incredible. Thank you very much, Hope. Here with me now is strong forward Jalen Orth. Jalen, how do you see Tori as a leader? Tori is definitely more of a leader by example, but I've played with Tori throughout the years, and I've seen her grow as well in the areas of um, speaking up and being more vocal on the court. Um, but she's always there for every single teammate. If someone's having a hard day, uh, she'll pull him aside and talk to him, and she just keeps us all centered on the court, which is a very valuable thing to have and a leader on our team. And thank you also, Jay Lenorth. And now joining us is Cece Burks. She's the opposite side shooting guard for the team. All right, Cece, um, how was Tori Nelson on the court? Tori Nelson on the court was probably one of the humblest people I've ever met. She was always a teammate who pushed you harder and always made sure you kept your head up. And if you did something bad on defense, she would always push you on offense and help you to get open and improve you more as improving herself. Uh, she was probably one of the best. She turned into a family for me on the court and off the court, but as a teammate, I played with Tori for a really long time, and she always pushed you, and I'll always remember that. <laughs> so, yeah. Well, great to talk to you, C.C. Berg. So, oh, and wait, on line three, we've got Coach Harry Jennis. All right, Coach, so what has it been like coaching Tori Nelson, and apart from the points and rebounds, what would you share about her? 
I've had the fortune to coach Tori for the last two years, and in that time I've been blessed to coach a person who is very talented, uh, very humble, and assertive. Always having a team first mentality, getting her teammates involved, also stepping up when the game is on the line. She's a leader with high character and, and hands down takes on the responsibilities on and off the court as a captain. She loves to play basketball uh, because it's fun. It's competitive, aggressive. She likes to have that little one-on-one -on -one battle against someone. Uh, she's very big into the in the team uh, first. But looking at her overall, I mean, she's one that when her teammates succeed, she is very happy about that. And she has definitely left an imprint and legacy at uh, Henry Sibley and on the girls basketball program. And it's going to be remembered for years to come. And she's just one of a kind. And uh, we all have been very fortunate to be a part of, of not only her success, um, but also have the opportunity to just get to know her as a person. Thanks so much, Coach. You can tell what an impact Tori has had on the program, the school, and the team. I'm now talking on the phone with Athletic Director Prentice Smith. Prentice, thanks for joining us today. What would you say the contributions and the great things that Tori Nelson has done for the school? Tori Nelson has been a trailblazer since she set foot on campus four years ago. She has done just a fantastic job in every facet um, that you could possibly ask of a student athlete in our building. Her connections that she makes with kids that are potentially a part of her team or not a part of her team, it doesn't matter. She's always willing to um, help them out in, in uh, any way that she possibly can. She has been recently honored as the Henry Sibley 2019 Athena Award winner. She has um, showed excellence in all facets of her sport, of the classroom, and in the community. She is going to be truly missed as a gem that all Warrior Nation is proud of. Congratulations, Tori, on an outstanding career. Well, folks, that wraps up the program. Tori is headed on to bigger and even better things as she heads to South Dakota State University on a basketball scholarship. But as we've heard, basketball or not, she's going to have a bright future and an impact on whatever community she's in. Сегодня Вашингтон выдвинул новые обвинения в отношении основателя Викиликс. Теперь Жулиану Ассанжу вместо пяти лет за решеткой могут дать срок в 35 раз больше. Из способника хакеров, как его раньше называл американский миньюст, Ассанж в одночасье стал шпионом. О том, почему власти США пошли на такой шаг и сделали это именно сейчас. Из Вашингтона наш собственный корреспондент Валентин Богданов. Good, good. Good, good. Good, good. Good, good. 